Hello everybody, Hawaii's only. Today we're foraging. So we're on the rocks here at Kaneohe Marine Corps Base. We're looking for opihi, which are limpets, and haukeuke, which is a Hawaiian uni, or um, sea urchin. So yep, just hang around. It's gonna be a great episode. I'll see you guys in a little bit. to the channel guys it's Kali D Shanks we produce videos every Wednesday and Saturday please hit that subscribe button I'm a little wet because um I just got cracks and pounded by the waves out there I didn't bring a GoPro because the waves are just a little too nuts um so what we're doing now is working the higher rocks or the safer side um limpets or opihi they're on the shoreline or the coast right where the waters pound and it's like they like that spot I think maybe that's where they feel safe or maybe that's where they eat i'm not too sure but that's where they are and that's where you got to get them so it's pretty dangerous you got to bring a butter knife you're walking on slippery rocks and then you're dodging waves but um as you guys can see we're in this uh area where it's kind of secluded you got to swim to the spot so right right now we're swimming back it's a it's a beautiful swim we're gonna dry off our gear we're gonna have a couple poo poos a couple beers get ready for the trek out of here and uh yeah so you can see our bag it's only half a ziploc gallon full we didn't overload because right now opihi it's kind of uh limited so we want to make sure that we have enough for the next generation or we have enough for the next party so we just take a little bit just take what you need and then we're out of here and then um yeah we got gifted some akule today so uh yeah you guys can see i'm just enjoying opihi right off the rock with chili pepper water it's so good but we got gifted some akule so we're gonna go back to the house and we're gonna chef up some akule poke it's gonna be a good one i'll see you guys in the kitchen So for our ingredients today, we have akule, opihi, haukiuke, which is the Hawaiian uni or the sea urchin, tomato, onion, inomona, and Hawaiian salt, and that's it. Oh, I'm sorry, green onion and chili peppers, that's it. So I'm gonna show you guys how to break down the haukiuke, I'm gonna show you guys how to clean opihi, and I'm gonna show you guys how to skin and break down the akule two different ways. Here we have the haukiuke or purple vana, um, sea urchin. This is uh, the spikeless sea urchin, so it doesn't have all the spines on it. Did I say spikeless or spineless? Anyhow, um, this is a smooth sea urchin. Um, we have this a lot here in Hawaii. You just get a cleaver, you crack it in half, and then you dig out the goods like we have here. So the purple vana right now, the haukuki, it's not in season, so um, it doesn't have a whole lot, but we, we got lucky with this one. We got some, and then, um, yeah, it's got a creamy, sweet flavor. Just like Japanese uni, it's super delicious. And for the opihi, you just take one spoon and then you scrape out the meat without busting the doo-doo bag. And then that's it. We'll just do this and put it on a paper towel to keep it dry. And then, um, yeah, we're gonna put this into our poke in a little bit. Now we're gonna break down the akule. Um, just a real simple uh, filet process. I'll put up another video on how to filet a fish 101. But basically, you just take your knife and you're gonna slit from the head to the belly and then you take your knife and you score the back from the tail to the head and then like you see here you're just gonna score the underbelly part from the belly to the tail and then you just take your knife and run it from the tail all the way up towards the head to remove the fillet as seen here and then um watch this you'll just see the fillet come right off and that's it that's how you fillet the fish and i'll make another video on this um you can click the one of the videos below Now that we have the fillet separated, you're gonna see the rib cage connecting to a little bone right at the middle of the fillet. So you have to turn your knife upside down and then crack that bone. And then you can take your knife and separate the belly meat as seen here. It was kind of quick, so I'll do it again and then you guys can kind of follow along. And then you take the base of your knife, start at the tail and just remove the skin, just like how we're doing here. Uh, once again, I'll do a cleaning fish or breaking down fish 101. And then right in the middle here, there's pin bones. So we're just gonna take our knife, the pin bones are connected to the bloodline. And you just run your knife to remove those pin bones and the bloodline. And uh, for a kule, the bones are real small and the bloodline is small. So I end up just throwing this away, even though I, on the bigger fish, I keep it and I cook it. But for a kule, cause it's so small, you can scrape it um, or you can fry it in, but it, it's got choke bones in it. And then you just take the fillets and you chop it up like how I'm doing here. And this is gonna be our akule poke. 
and then we're gonna repeat this process with the other couple fish that we got. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to do the uh, removal of the skin without um, using your knife to remove the skin. Exact same cuts, going from head to belly, score the back, and then we're gonna score the underside belly. You're just gonna score it, not deep cuts. The reason you're gonna score it is you're gonna just get that um, skin to separate. You see that flap? So once you make all your scores, the three cuts, now you're just gonna pull slowly the skin back, holding down the head of the fish and the belly, and then you're just gonna remove the skin and then you don't even have to use your knife. So this is another way that you can remove skin um, for the akule, and then you go ahead and just remove your filet, and then we're gonna chop that up and then put it into our poke bowl. Next, we're just gonna do regular poke ingredients, chili pepper, green onion, tomatoes, sweet onion, inamona, and Hawaiian salt. And that's it. And then we're gonna throw in a couple of those opihis into our akule poke. If we didn't have the opihi, I wouldn't put it in, but because we do, I'm gonna put some in there and then I'm also gonna leave some on the side. And uh, yeah, let's get to eating. <laughs> yeah, that's good. And this is Hawaiian style. It's just sitting on a bed of poi. Right here. Oh my gosh. So this poke here, this is one of my. This is really, really, really good. All right, guys, you guys saw it. We got the uh, fresh opihi, we had the haukuke, we had our lomi akule or big eye scab poke. Um, I ate it with the poi, it was super delicious. Um, Slipped on my chili pepper water, and it's time for bed. Thank you guys for joining me for another episode. I'll see you guys next week, Saturday. Aloha.